Let me clutch thee. I have thee not. But yet I see thee still. Art thou not fatal vision sensible to feeling as to sight? Or art thou but a dagger of the mind? A false creation proceeding from the heat oppressive brain? I see thee yet. In form as palpable as this which now I draw. Thou marshals me the way that I was going. <laughs> Who in the lusty stealth of nature take more composition and fierce quality than doth within a dull, stale, tired bed to go to the creating a whole tribe of fops? Who shall be true to us when we are so unsecret to ourselves? Though I loved you, and yet, good faith, I wished myself a man were that we women had men's privilege of speaking first. Oh, sweet, quickly hold my tongue. Why do you look on me? I see no more in you than in the ordinary of nature's self. That drop of blood that's calm proclaims me bastard. Christ cuckled to my father. Brands the harlot, even here between the chaste, unsmirched brow of my true but mother. Where is my father? How came he dead? I'll not be juggled with! To hell, allegiance, vows to the blackest devil, conscience and grace to the profoundest pit. I, from the Orient to the drooping West, making the wind my post horse, still unfold the acts commenced on this ball of earth. Upon my tongue's continual slanders ride, the which in every language I pronounce, stuffing the ears of men with false reports. I speak of peace, while covert enmity, under the smile of safety, wounds the world. Something rash. 